Hello and welcome my friends. We have some T1 skins finally being released. It's uh, yeah, it's about time. It's like what nine months or eight months ish kind of uh, Yeah, that 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 was a long period of time Obviously, we got the like T1 faker Ari skins kind of but uh, now we finally have our world skins and Get right into it, right? <clears throat> We're starting here with the Jinx skin. Okay, let's see. Let's see Okay, okay that's a dog that's supposed to be like I don't know a pet or something okay signature very nice overall uh, from the like color scheme and so on it's okay it's okay so far let's take a closer look though it, it reminds me a bit of like Sc star guardian right but uh, yeah okay animations everything nice I want to look at the skin a bit more cause uh, I'm looking for like some Easter Easter eggs or something like something Goomer or T1 related. Uh, yeah, animations so far looks very b uh, beautiful. This uh, I don't know about the blue in there. Like T1, I mean, I look at the drip again. We are like black and red. Uh, like having the white is okay, right? G white, gold, red. Color scheme that works pretty well. Okay, nice T1 emblem there on the uh, what is it E again? That's overall pretty cool. Yeah, overall, not maybe the best skin of all time, um, but I mean, Jinx is, it's a bit tough, right? That looks pretty dope though. Ooh, T1, let's go. Uh, anything else that's super special and interesting? Okay, well, nothing. Yeah, okay, can continue, continue. Okay, that's the passive. Oh, a nice T1 emblem under her feet okay okay we take it we take it overall yeah let's go what do we have next is that crit animation or something oh death animation let's go back okay oh Blah. okay yeah nothing too special here i think uh, oh what is that a chroma oh i don't know if i like the chroma more it's like evil version or something uh but yeah overall um uh, I don't know high rating this is the bard skin okay let's look oh my god what they added the luck skin for oh my god okay that's great that's great right games 10 out of 10 points for for the luck skin okay use our bard bore overall it's uh let's uh pause when he looks forward okay nice cue I want to take a closer look at, at the bard guy. So it's like a bunny or rab yeah, rabbit bunny. I, I think that's the same. Um, like Korean style dress or at least Asian. Maybe not the biggest expert on that yet, but uh, obviously inspired. We have the same color scheme going on, right? The, the yellow, yellow, the gold and the white. Oh, and the, what is that? Is that supposed to be a stew or a tea? like a soup oh my god oh my look at this there is a fucking lux face underneath oh whoever did this he cooked man he cooked i don't know if this is pbe so i don't know if it stays but that's cool that's fucking cool okay great man uh actually the chimes are world trophies Luckily, they look way better than the regular ones. The portals, can we see some more? Entrance looks good, traveling looks good. Yeah, absolutely great skin, I'd say. The meeps are like small little bunnies. Again, I don't get the animal parts there. Oh, okay, that's that's nice. But I mean, it's pretty simple, right? Big circle, make the T1 emblem there, and uh, that's great. Also, maybe it's just me, but the, the Zonias, the gold, looks different from the normal Zonias effect. And uh, yeah, animation so far so good. We're waiting for the death animation here any moment now. What happens? Does looks come out of him or what? No. Okay, nothing too special there. And that's the other skin. Again, the, the, the Chroma version also looks good, I'd say. Um, yeah, not, not, not a bad, uh, but I think the original one, I like it better. We're not looking at uh, the here. Skin Spotlight, by the way, obviously, uh, yeah. We're stealing your content here. We're reacting to your videos. Good videos, obviously. Okay, that's the Jace one. This is the basic one. Um, 
we're watching that first and then the what is it the no it's not prismatic prestige skin then comes later actually let's watch that again didn't pay attention what is this what are these symbols supposed to mean i don't know maybe the different roles or something i, I don't know but uh yeah looked okay looked okay um actually what was the jinx recall animation i need to pay more attention uh whatever so auto attacking here pretty basic the skin overall in terms of uh, its drip uh, not going too far from like original jace designs and again the color scheme stays fairly similar i think it could have been cool if the color scheme uh like changes right if you now he's like in the hammer form it's red and if he goes into a uh, range form it goes blue maybe they did that but that could have been a cool uh like option here but overall yeah the coloring is fine pretty nice pretty smooth a okay, hammering Ooh, nice like the red eyes are glowing oh actually they did it blue hammer form and uh what is it red no i'm just mixing stuff up whatever blue range red hammer or melee whatever yeah looks good good w so on so on let's watch the portal now any moment e okay that looks weird it looks very very big looks way bigger than it probably is right due to the what is it the wings there uh yeah i don't know i don't like that this is like misjudging the situation but the the uh, empowered shock blast looks uh, looks dope now we need the the charge or the slam yeah again that that looks i mean that looks like really impactful right it's uh, empowered shock blast but we need the e the the hammer form e the charge we don't get it or did i miss it already let's go back we see it here already the charge oh this is just w jump no no jump okay go back here is the crits and the death animation okay now yeah, nothing too crazy uh and yeah here we're already spoiling we're not looking at the middle one uh let me go back and look at the left one is that an skt version if i look at the but where's my mouse if we look here is that supposed to be like an skt so is this like t1 and this skt chroma or something is that like uh, how they're going this uh regardless skin looks good um so far the bard one is the best one but obviously with bard you can do a lot more than with just jace and jinx uh jace obviously still has more options due to six abilities uh than jinx with just four right uh but yeah i'm still still optimistic we still have a couple more to look at and this one looks insane what the fuck this is like wow i need to take on some some sh fucking shades or something then the gold looks distinct i don't know if i like it too much or if it's just too, uh or if it's, uh, it's too much bling bling but uh yeah i mean here we have like some amethyst purple thingy and uh well a very bright gold Oh, here we got the charge by the way the e and uh yeah i mean i'm going to get this i'm already uh, i've already invested in the what is it mythic essence um and uh, i think it's on the cheaper side as well if i'm not uh, mistaken but uh yeah looks good looks good yeah we'll, uh, we'll definitely uh, buy this one i'm going to buy any all of them anyway and okay normal shock blast okay it's okay nice visibility so it's not unfair or something right there are always these abilities that are invisible on the background in summoner's rift it's not that bad but like if you play alternative game game modes like aram or arena where the ground is like in a different color sometimes uh yeah like some abilities can be quite nasty or if you're in river right blue on blue and this this one yeah i don't know man the x uh i want to see the power truck last a bit more from longer range maybe it looks maybe it looks good but maybe not as like impactful of a blast than the uh, than the normal one but i like the gates way more they are more clean not as like extravagant uh 
yeah. And now the death animation any moment. Okay, it's the same animation just with the different skin. What are those pants actually? What the hell are those? It's like 80s pants or something. Maybe 70s? I don't know man, I was not born that time. But uh, yeah, prestige skin, pretty nice. Uh, it's not much of an upgrade, but uh, prestiges are just chromas anyway, to some extent. This is the uh, Lee Sin skin here for our boy owner. Let's see. Ooh. Okay. Okay, that one was pretty dope. That's a cool recall animation. Owner fighting Lee Sin and then the jacket. I'm obviously wearing the jacket wrong here for this one, but uh, yeah, that's what it is. Again, we have the blue and red. This time, like one fist being each color. It's okay. But uh, we'll see, we'll see. So far, Q is okay. Yeah, good visibility, not unfair or anything. But uh, what do we have next? Okay, max range Q. This was that. With the W. Oh, okay. Looks pretty good. Looks pretty good. Overall, I can't complain so far. Like the animations, the colors. All have been high quality animations or particles and something like that. Just using buzzwords, I don't know, man. <laughs> but yeah, good, good. Auto attacks, anything special? Maybe E? Okay, E using the T1 thing, kind of as expected. And then the slow, looking fine. Yeah, man, that, that looks like a fucking E where you one shot the entire enemy team with like full authority, Lisa, or some shit. Let me see the kick here again. Yeah, it's okay. It's okay. I mean, is there a Timon emote or a Timon icon? Let me see again. Yeah, maybe a small one. Maybe that's supposed to be a T1 icon there. Or, yeah, is it icon? Emblem? And here, yeah. Looks good, looks good. No, I think we can agree that it looks good. Okay, the crit. Oh. We skip the death. Let's see, does he get a unique death animation? Uh, not really. Yeah, well, it's okay. And uh, yeah, again, the other version. By the way, his legs look so thin. Is that for every Lee Sin skin? I don't know, maybe it's the pants. I'm wearing like weird pants in these. And uh, yeah, we're now coming to the all important one for Faker. Uh, Faker's fourth T1 skin. It's Oriana, obviously, right? Not the Ari. Anyway, let's see. Recall animation. It's a dragon. Okay, dancing. Okay. Yeah, I like this. Oh, I like this very much. So far, I think that's the best recall animation. The Lux one is good, but it's more Mimi. Uh, yeah, I think this is the one that's like just generically beautiful. Auto attacks look pretty nice. You, uh, it looks good, bro. He's rushing through the spotlight already. QW auto attacks. W looks good. I don't like the ball too much. I think it's like too much added onto it. I like Oriana balls when they're like really just the a ball and uh, looking good. Like that's why I think uh, the what is it, Dark Star? Wait. Okay, old. 3, 2, 1. Yeah, let's watch it again. I don't know why there's... If we pause at the right moment... What is... Like, why is there, like, all kinds of, like, different stuff here? There's some references. Oh, this is the references! Let's take a look. What do we have here? Uh, this is obviously, like, Z, Right? Z played Azir. This is uh, the scrolls from Rice. I don't know what... What is this? What? What is? Ah, huh? what? What is it supposed to be? Is this Ah Sundra? Oh, of course, of course. So Sundra, Rise, Z. This is like the three other like Faker skins for T1, and then obviously Azir, which uh, there's a T1 Azir skin or an SKT skin, uh, but that's obviously Easy Hoons. Uh, but yeah, that actually I mean this is a bit weird that it's in here. But yeah, this is interesting. Looks uh, like maybe a bit weird, but uh, nice homage, right? Yeah, again, I think it's cool. Phew. Yeah, nice. 
But the ball, I don't know if I like the ball all too much, honestly. Uh, it looks all very great. Also, I don't know, the auto attacks don't feel like as strong. They look good. Again, here we have the crit animation. Um, and the death animation. Nothing special. You can look under her skirt. What the fuck? Riot Games. Hello? What is that? What the fuck is this? What the fuck? Hello? The game for kids. Why do we see panties? Hi, uh... Uh... Yeah, again, the red ones, they all look alright, but I prefer the, the normal ones. Uh, yeah, the Oriana skin, pretty nice. Uh, overall, what do we say? What do we say, my friends? Uh, this is the best recall animation, I think, out of all of them. The barb one is pretty fucking funny, though. That's what's uh, the Jinx animation again. Ah, this was the one with the dog. Okay, now I remember, now I remember. So, uh, yeah, the recall animations, right? All pretty fine. Not sure why he has a dog. Maybe he has like a dog pet that I don't remember anything about. Yeah, I don't know. I'm not stalking them on their personal life if they... Do they even use like social media that much? Regardless, regardless. Uh, skins are good. Skins are good. Overall, we can be decently happy. Um... The color scheme is like linked to T1. We were worried like somewhat for like Faker, right? Because the sense of let's call it fashion is uh, sometimes pretty interesting. Uh, but yeah, can't really complain too much, right? With also tech based champions like Jinx or Jace. Uh, sure, Jace has his Q and Jinx has her R. But uh, in terms of like design and animation potential, it's just a bit rough. Um, but that's also a positive because like Riot Games can fuck anything up and do anything cringy. Um, the Bart ones is like Bart overall pretty fun. Uh, obviously, a fun characteristic champion, right? With the Lux add ons, that's pretty neat. Um, but yeah, I don't want to ramble on for like way much longer. We already talked about skins for 20 minutes, man. I don't know what I'm what are we doing, but yeah, yeah, buy this, buy, buy the skins, they're great. Uh, I will buy all of them, I will buy the Prestige one as well. Uh, not sure about the Chromas, well, uh, we'll see, we'll see. Uh, maybe they're all in a bundle and then I'll just grab the chromas as well. And let me know your thoughts. Uh, did I miss any easter eggs or interactions um, that uh, you want to let me know about? And uh, yeah, are you going to buy them? I, I hope you are. Um, probably going to be expensive, right? Skin inflation is also hitting high. Uh, yeah, anyway, take care and uh, yeah, we're seeing each other in the near future with more T1 content. Bye bye.